welcome King Lizard, Xbox 360 and Forza Motorsport 4. Um, trip back in time to Road America with the number 91 Areco GTRS Dodge Viper. A um, little bit of an accident there in the first corner. That car had a major spin out, of course, a major pile up behind. The Selena 7 following me closely there behind. Um, this is actually my own machine, but although this particular vehicle is one of the race class vehicles, the R2 um, vehicles in Forza Motorsport 4 and Motorsport 3. Um, pretty good stock car out of the box. Um, however, I've made some fine-tune adjustments just to make it that a little bit better on the gearing and also some better handling. Um, so if you're interested in my tune, you can get that by my storefront called Motorsport 4 um, under my game tag, which is K-I-N-G space L-I-Z-Z-A-R-D. So King space Lizard with two Zs, all in lowercase. Um, Unfortunately, I did have a lot of genes um, which I've lost due to a safe game corruption. Or save, you know, safe game overwrite thanks to the cloud. Um, so I'm kind of rebuilding and re going through the event list now, and I thought as I was doing that, um, I'd take great pleasure in recording some bits for the uh, King Lizard's game later. As for the you know, Motorsport 4 is probably still the best driving game. At least on, on you know, Microsoft console. Um, I've not played any of the um, newer variants of the Sony, you know, Sony's monsters, uh, like you know, GT, GT um, 6 or anything like that. So um, I'll be honest, though, Grand Turismo it was a good game, but I just didn't like its mechanic and you know, it was quite limiting. I found I prefer this game you know, over GT any day of the day. So into our first lap, left the computers are dead. I am actually racing in automatic, um, and I'm racing against hard computers here. Uh, obviously that big smash at the beginning of the race, um, where that car span out, it's obviously taken a lot of our action. Um, damage is on at this point, I do have some kind of left side steering damage, it's giving me a little bit of trouble. Nothing too much. I was fortunate not to take any engine damage, so um, car still running really well at this point. And for, you know, for, I think this was a 2012 game. I think mean, 2012 game. I think this still looks and looks fantastic. Um, I think it's still got a reasonable community out there. Um, I must admit I've abandoned it probably for the last year after my loss of save data but you know, I still love the game very much. I'm just a little bit disgruntled that I lost 69% of the event list that I've concluded, um, which is one of the very few achievements I've left on death. Um, obviously I'm trying again, which is why I'm back in here. So try and do a variant of different recordings um, and different cars and different classes for you guys on the uh, King Lizard's Game Lounge and then make a playlist. Um, now obviously when you're watching these, I mean in this case I've actually chose just to record the replay because it is a, a five lap race, uh, sorry three lap race of Road America. Um, you know it's a pretty big track, I didn't want to bore you too much um, with me driving and replay so obviously I'm not sure what your preference is whether you prefer seeing me in you know driving a car um, whether you would like to see both in separate videos or whether you're quite happy having them combined into a you know in car experience playing the game and then a replay or whether you're just happy with these replays um, so do leave me some feedback like the video dislike the video um, and also please do subscribe um, I do love my games, I'm hoping one day I can do enough of this to hopefully make myself some money um, and maybe make it a full time position. But um, right now it's just a hobby. Um, you know, I love games, I'm going to share that with 
community out there which I want to make community aware of any games that I find that aren't that great but also more importantly games that aren't great and that should be in your collection. So I mean if you own a an Xbox 360 and you don't own those you cause a motorsport or this is the best game you can buy for your console. It is a little bit silly, but once you get into this game, you know, there's a mammoth amount of things you can do. Um, there's also monthly driver events still supported um, by turn 10, so they're still making monthly driver events for this game, um, you know, several years after it's been replaced. Um, it's still got a reasonable community. really comes into its own when you're playing against other people on, you know, probably your friends because you get fairer races but, um, you know, playing online can also be quite exciting sometimes, although unfortunately sometimes quite frustrating. I think the good thing about probably joining the community now is the majority of people who are playing this game now are people that are, have got an allegiance to it and a love for it and they're probably going to be fair, you know, fair drivers in the majority of them. So, or at least that's my experience anyway, is the community is a lot more um, fairer than it used to be when this game first came out. So we're into the final straight, I'll take this opportunity to thank you for watching. Um, as I said, please rate, please subscribe if you want to, and thanks for watching, I'll be back again soon. Take care.